everyone, I'm here today and I'm going to be doing um, a little different video. I'm going to do a challenge video. It was on YouTube and it's going to be the 3x3 challenge. Basically, you just need to have any type of house and it only could be three squares um, wide, but it could be as many as you'd like long. So I'm going to start out with a single sin, so it can be a starter home. So we'll see. Let me go ahead and find one that I can go ahead and move in. And we'll do the 3x3 challenge and we'll see how I do. Maybe a single sim. So it will be under 20,000. There we go. Let me go ahead and move her in. Here. She's, she's going to have 1650 to work with. It's a little bit of a larger lot. It's a 30 by 20 so, we'll see what I can do with that. Thinking it's going to look more like a trailer or something. I want it to be modern because it's going to be super tiny and I want it to have a large window. So we'll see if I'll be able to. So I do have the mod in my game for the snow. So the light snow, and that is by Sim Cookie. So that's the reason being um, with a little bit of snow here, just so you guys are aware. Okay, so we'll get right into it, and we will start building. Okay, so it can only be three by. Oh my gosh! I can. <laughs> How in the hell? Okay, wait. <laughs> Three wide and could be however much long you'd like it to be, so maybe too big. That's already ten thousand dollars. Yeah, that's too big. Okay. Um houses. <sighs> I don't know how this is going to turn out, but we will try it. So, we will see. Okay. Looks like a very large, uh, very odd shaped home. You know how it says um, this is going to be $219? I found a trick that all you need to do is delete the little wall that's behind and you get your money back. So the stairs are actually completely free. I just got $340 back. So if you don't mind the little part of your stairs not having the back, save some money. Save some money because you're going to need it, especially with this challenge. So I need to have lots of windows because it's very small. That way they can feel like it's not as small as it is. <laughs> if that makes any sense. Um, I feel like if you have large windows and you know lots of available light, you'll be able to um, feel like it's more open, even though. <laughs> pretty tiny, but no one has to know that, you know? I mean, inside you'll feel like you're in a very large, large area here. This is going to be the bathroom, and I'm going to put the bedroom back here as well. Bedroom will be there, bathroom. So it's going to be a pretty small house because it's going to be for one sim, and we'll see what I can do. We will see. These to be the counter heights. So let me go ahead and grab a counter really quickly.
130, and these are 135. Let me make sure I got the 130. Okay, I did. Trying to have as many windows as I can, but you know what? We are on a budget, so we will see what we can do. So I think that's going to be it for that. The roof might be a bit of a challenge, but we'll see. to go into the outside of the house here and I'm gonna go for a bit of a lighter tone Let's see don't know if I like that I don't like the A lot cheaper. So we have different colors, they don't, and that is the. I mean, this isn't always a spring, so. I don't like the way it looks. Maybe I'll change the color of this. Try one more different type of roof and see what happens. Let's see. Just really quickly and see if this looks a little better. Obviously, it would never be this tall. I don't know why they do this. I think it looks a lot better. It looks a lot better. What do you guys think? <laughs> so we'll see. I'm gonna go for a budget friendly home. Um, something that it's gonna be. Alright, so let's 
that. Alright, so. I think that will be the outside for now. I'm not going to work. I don't worry too much of the landscaping because we don't have too much extra money. Um, do a little bit, but not too much. Oops. So for now, we will just kind of try and work with what we have. And let's see. Alrighty, so I'm I'm liking this. I'm liking this. So we can work with that. We can work with that. Let's see that. Okay. So most of the dining and kitchen area will be wood. I'll have carpet in a couple areas of the house. The bedroom obviously would be carpet. Another little sitting area will be right here and that will be carpet. And then we will also have the tile. The cheapest one is $4. Something fun like this, maybe. They have different colors. They... It's a little bit lighter. So that's, that's good. Lighter colors are always better when you have a small space. So we will try our best to accommodate the sim so she's comfortable. Just living in the 3x3, three three, but you know what? We will try our best. Oh, that's really funky. That's $4, $2 for these. I'm trying to find like the cheapest one that's like the nicest. I don't really care for this top part, but I mean, what can you do? Let's see how much the paint is. The paint's dollars as well, okay. Light pastels are always nice. You can always pick like a nice yellow. I might do a light blue in the bedroom. Throughout the house, I'll do this color here. It's like a light. It seems like it's a light, very, very light. Um, this is $2 as well. And you also get a little bit, bit of a border. So that's nice. I like that peach, actually. Yeah, I like that one a lot better. So let's go ahead and I think I'm actually gonna change the restroom and put it for wood, but I'm gonna put it the light, the white wood. Perfect. Alright. So, I mean, that's the inside of the house and it looks pretty good. I like it. So we're gonna, we're gonna go ahead with the kitchen. Pop another counter down. Change the color of these. And you're gonna get <laughs> you're gonna get the cheapest. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, girl. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to do this to you, but you know what? We're on a budget, honey, and you're gonna have to deal with what I give you. <laughs> I'm gonna have a little sitting area back here, which will be nice. And let's see here. We're gonna have these chairs. No. These chairs are nice, but I don't like this table. So I'm gonna keep the chairs, but let me go ahead and take that out. That's too much white. <laughs> it's just me. I like. Give it some color. <laughs> okay. Oh. Alright, so this is the little dining room area, which is super cute. I really, really like it. And a splurge on the little light there. Not getting anything extra yet, so we'll see. We'll get the necessities and stop 
Um, I'm so used to like spending kind of a lot of money when I build, so this is a challenge for me. It really is. Um, one counter and uh, I need a stove. Oh my gosh. I don't know if I'm going to be able to do this with all this amount of money, but we'll see. I'll give you a white stove and let me make sure you're safe, girl. You know, I don't want you to uh, burn the house down. That's all you got. <laughs> And we'll have the bathroom over here. Oh, I do need the doors. So I'm going to get the cheapest door. Fortunately, I'm going to have to get the cheapest one. And it looks nicer if the door is in the middle. But I feel like when I'm in a small space, I'm going to need all the space I can handle. This is 250. This is 275. I feel like the showers are a lot quicker though in the game. I feel like when you take a bath in the game, it takes forever and a day for you to finish. So we'll have the... I might splurge in the bathroom. She seems like a girl that might be interested. Let's see, we'll see. We will see, we will see. Okay. So the bathroom's not going to have any crazy colors, except like a splash of pink rug. <laughs> Let's see. Uh, this one's nice. Can you make these larger? And you can. Wow. That is awesome. I did not know that. That is pretty sweet. It's an awesome pop of color and it's a lot cheaper. Once you change the size though, you will not be able to... Charge that 50 bucks? Okay. Well, we'll see. We'll see. If I have enough, I have about 6,000 simoleons left, so... <laughs> kind of worried but um all right so let's go ahead and work on the bedroom make sure you have somewhere to sleep give you a comfortable bed i'm gonna give you a twin i'm gonna give you the cheapest twin oh that bed is so cute That's okay. Her bedroom is going to be... Too bright? I think that is. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Three by three. It's pretty hard, actually. Three by three is so hard to do. Ugh. I don't know about this. Oh my god. Oh no. Alright, so. Having a little mini freak out because I'm not used to working with this low of a budget. So we will try my best here to <laughs> furnish this house and let's see, living room. I have about 4,000 simoleons left, so it's not too bad. Um, I'm used to using a lot more furniture, a lot larger items, so we'll see. Let's see here. And I'm going to work with a small dining table and 
the TV. Yep, you're getting the penguin TV. I'm sorry. You're just, you're just gonna get the penguin TV. I can't help it. It's, the TV is so cute. I don't know why. I just I like it so much. I really do hope some sims can fit in here because <laughs> it's fairly small it's a little cramped but you know what it's it's cutesy it just fills the space up a bit and you know what she's she's okay with that she's living um just living simple that's what you want to call it want to go through the wall okay cool alrighty so she is gonna have some blinds out front just because she doesn't want everyone to be able to look in her house so just for the front there you go you got some little shelves here Oh my gosh, I feel like I'm running out of money. I don't know what my deal is. All right, so you're gonna have a little sitting area here, which would be cute. The table is so big. I don't know why they do that. It's like really, really, really large. It's just insane. A little side table, but I don't want it to be super huge. Like, I want it to fit. You know what? I think we're gonna have to do. We're gonna have to use one of these little tables right here. And I need to use the BB dot move objects cheat. So this is just for, this is just then my items will fit. So I have about 2,000 left, which is pretty good. I can just go ahead and decorate up a bit. So that's nice. Let me put some shelves. And get this going here. Some decorative shelves around. Kind of fill the walls a bit because it's a little bare. But you know what? It will work out well once I finish. storage and stuff like that because you know when you live in an apartment you need as much storage as possible you guys should know that Let's see can i have her become an artist she's an outdoor enthusiast let's see she likes to 
do her yoga. <laughs> How much was that? It was 125. <laughs> because I'm already like wasting money on like simple things like that. But you know what? I don't feel like it's wasting money when it is. It's much needed. That's for sure. That one is too big for that area. Let's see here. That one is way too big, I think. This one's better if it's small. That's too huge too. What's going on with this? Let's see. Let's see, let's see. Can I put some blinds in here? Let's see if what will fit. Mm. It doesn't look too bad, does it? I think it fills the space nicely. Let's see. And... So right now, I just really need some decor items. Some just nice, like, staple. Let's see. Kitchen. I don't have very much storage space. Um, I think I have about 760 simoleons left, so I really have to be careful of what I purchase. and ends. I'm just gonna like see what could fit here just because it doesn't seem like there's that much space. Having a hard time. I have $300 left. Okay. Let's see here. I'm trying to use everything. It's probably because I splurged a little bit on the lot so she can um, upgrade later on. Let's see. All right, about $250 left. It's not too bad. Um, I'm trying to see if I could. Just need a trash can outside. Ugh. All right. Well. Oh yeah. She needs a trash can in the house. She needs. All right. So she'll get the trash can in the house, and I think that will be it.
Oh, I don't have enough for counters. Okay. I mean, not counters. I didn't have enough for... I don't know if it's something in the bedroom. Let's see. Okay. Making out still. I don't have that much money left. These simoleons. <laughs> Well, it looks like that's it. She has exactly zero simoleons left. So that was my 3x3 three three challenge. I hope you guys do enjoy. So I'll go ahead and just take you in, show you around really quickly. Make sure she can sit down everywhere. Let's see. Let's see how it goes. Let's see. All right. So you can go ahead and come in. Use the restroom, honey. Because you have to go. So this is going to be a mini Let's Play and a 3x3 three three challenge, so I hope you guys did enjoy. We'll go ahead and speed through really quickly, make sure she can use all the items, make sure she can sit here and sit here. And you can sit here. Yeah, so she, she can use everything it seems like. Um, everything is usable. Everything is very close, but you know what? When you look at it, she does have a lot of space. I'm going to pause this. So this is the dining area. It's very nice, very nice. Nice windows, cute little kitchen area, aww. <laughs> and this little, little living room, so precious. And when you first walk in, you see little knickknacks. You have a little entryway here that separates into a little library. You can look out, see who's coming down the street. You can see, oh, my mail's coming, my man, okay. So, and then the bedroom is super cute. I know it's tight, but she can still fit, so it's really good. Let's go ahead and make sure she can fit, and she, she can take a nap. Yeah, she's, she's good. She's good. Yeah, see? Perfect. All right, I hope you guys have a great day wherever you are. Happy swimming.